But I spoke about it when I was holding my opening speech, and I said that uh, most of the issues that saying that there are no timely response, like Utah's, the Utah's situation, uh, uh, need to finish the assessment and put up a report. We we'll all copy the reports, education, finance, and uh, everybody. I called them up, and they said they didn't get the report. So I forwarded the report to them from the Minister of uh, 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 Communications and Digital Economy, which neither is under. And I said, this, uh, this is the report. is for your information and necessary action. That's how government works. I sent that on the 12th of December. They now replied uh, Nida through me on uh, Febu in February, about the second of February. So who has uh, wasted time? I took uh, their response again, sent down to uh, uh, Nida, copied uh, the finance, copied the education, copied everybody. This is the response of uh, uh, Asu. Some of these things are not supposed to be done by my ministry, but we, we, we are proactive about this. Well, about anything education, anything about health, we are proactive about that. So now that you have told me that, that I'm not uh, done the right thing, the next logical thing to do, which is now what we have agreed again today, is that the two technical teams of NIDA and ASU will meet and iron out the areas of differences. And that's what we are ended up agreeing today. While I have been doing that under correspondences by writing and telling them that this is what it should be. So as far, as far as I'm concerned, I was doing what I'm supposed to do. And the government is supposed to do what they are supposed to do. So we have agreed on UTAS now. That's, we are going to uh, uh, do a joint test, both technical teams. And they find uh, the areas of uh, reconciliation because Utah's on its own is a homegrown system. And the uh, executive order, presidential order three and five encourages homegrown system, uh, local content. So we, we should be able to encourage them. And that's uh, what I, I told them. But they, they have this uh, uh, phobia, uh, I can say suspicion that government doesn't want anything other than IPs. And I kept on telling them, no matter what system you have, no matter what solution you have, it must have a handshake with IPs so that the government will know about their funds and their movement of the funds. So that is it. So many things, uh, you know, countries go to war because of uh, lack of information or misinformation. So I'm asking them to brief their people appropriately and then call off the strike before the, uh, the expiration of the time they're talking about. So by Monday, uh, I will have got back to, on, to them on some of the issues and invite them back for the, for the discussion. Thank, Thank you so much.